What is going on everybody? Lou and Mary here from the Long Island Dash Experience. Today is Sunday, May 29th, and we're going out for a morning afternoon shift uh, for four hours. We're actually on our way right now to Soul Bowl just to get ourselves a little bit of a uh, smoothie for brunchish type so, of thing. So no morning coffee today. So yeah, no morning coffee today. We're gonna be going straight through, grinding it out. Uh, as always, Mary's gonna give you a goal. 130. 130 bucks, all right? So, I have a feeling we're gonna crush it today. Let's see what happens. Oh, it's going to Soul Bowl. <laughs> I mean, we kind of like expect to get something like that here. This is perfect. Six bucks, 0 0.7 miles, get to start it off. And the last time we started off with a Soul Bowl on a Sunday, it ended up being a monster day. A Michael's order, $17.98 with three items going 7.2 miles. How, how, how long? Uh, 7.2 miles here in the oil. How much Deer Park. is it? $17.98. What is it? Is it just like yarn? I don't know what it is. Oh, it's shoes? It's like shoes. And they're going to oil the deer park. It's going to take forever. No, it's not shoes. What the heck is that? Hey, you got a clue. Why don't you pick this up and, and we'll, s if it's still there. I'm back. This time I'm picking up. This time I'm picking up for somebody else. Christine M. Just enjoying my soul bowl in the car, waiting for an order to come in, and here we are. <laughs> Have a good one. You know what? I took it because it went up to $19. Okay, cool. Yeah, and I'm sure you're confident. Well, I, I know nothing about Michaels, but I'm sure you're confident with it. Mm. And then we'll be over oh, in that area. Oh, it's boxes. We'll be by, you know. Oh, we'll... it's all cake stuff. Oh, okay. Perfect. Yeah. I don't know anything about this stuff, but okay. I trust you, and you know Michaels. I've never even stepped foot yeah, in that place. Literally, all three of these things. I mean, it's five items, but but three different items. They're all like in the same area. Oh, and you know where they are? Perfect. Hopefully, they got them. But yeah, 19 bucks now. Yeah. All right, nice. Yeah, it went up two dollars in the in the time you walked out until I took yeah. it. And we'll probably like we're gonna drop this off in what? A second? In like three minutes? Two minutes? And we're probably in front of Michael's probably ten minutes away? No, not even. Not even? Because we're heading towards Sunrise Highway. Yeah. Hop on to Sunrise Highway. We're maybe eight, five minutes. And at most, at most to the customer it's probably gonna take us like fifteen minutes. Leave at door, leave on porch bench by door, please. I like the please. Big supporter of the please. But this is perfect, I mean, because if we can get this done by like 11.40, I don't know if we can get, yeah, I think we can. Then even even still, we'll be- Well, the shop will definitely be done. <laughs> you mean the whole thing? Mm -hmm. Depends on how long it takes to get To, to get, get to there. The... Because it's gonna depend on lights, because we're gonna probably be dealing with lights. Well, maybe not too many. It's yeah, better. it did go up there. I almost had a chance to take a screenshot because it was still showing up in my thing for half a second. What, but... Was it 1998? Yeah, it was, so yeah, it did go up. I was like, yeah, I can get the screenshot real quick. <laughs> And it was a good tip too. I think it was like a I mean, $7 tip or for something. For 19 bucks, it has to be. Because remember, it's $7 base pay and it's only three items. Then that has to have a good tip. Yeah. But it, it was sitting around for a while because the base was up to like to like $12. So you just gotta hope they had the stuff and people just haven't can didn't cancel it without, you know. I wonder if a lot of people take it to look at it and then throw it back. It's always possible. But the only issue with that and it's a good plan, and I like it, and we're gonna do it, is that does count towards your cancellation rate. And your cancellation rate, you can only cancel 15% of your orders in the last, right. what is the exact number actually? What is that metric? But it was 50. I think it's 50, right. So 15% to ensure customers receive their orders in time. Well, they should all back. However, if we understand sometimes you're unable to complete an order, you accepted. If you're unable to complete a uh, cancellation rate, right now. 100, okay, good. And I've only done like 15 orders. This might be about like 20th order. A rookie. Cancellation rate doesn't kick in until you've done at least 30 batches. You, your cancellation rate doesn't start until you've done at least 30 until batches. Until you've completed. Accepted. Mm. So if you accept the batch and then cancel it, that counts towards your Got it. 30. So basically, you can cancel 15 out of every 100. So you just gotta keep that in mind when you click on a batch, you know, like we've been talking about how like, a sixty-three dollar batch that we didn't take the other night. That we should have just clicked on it, accepted it, taken a look, and then throw it back. But that would have been two, two, three. No, because it's it's that's one batch. Oh, okay. That's the cool thing about. And about, even though there were two different stores, yeah, still it's considered one? one batch. Got it. Damn, I think they moved everything. Well, I remember, I remember being here once. Just once. This is very angry. They moved all the wolves and stuff. Great. Now I don't know where it is. Great. And they don't have aisles. They used to be right here. Did you send a welcome message? Oh no. Uh, what are you looking for? The baking area. Baking? It used to be right up there. This is the baking stuff. I thought it was shoes. All right, metallic. 
baking square. Three piece. Is it this 12? 12 inch? Yes. Or could I have found. found. Is that Skip a UPC? You 100% sure what is that? Yeah. Celebrate, celebrate it. 12 inch mm -hmm. metallic gold board. Yep. Okay. And just Skip one. scanning. Uh, item is correct. I don't know why they don't give UPC codes. Yep. Okay. And then boxes. Since we I need... don't have a cart, I'm just going to hold it. Good man. It's just, wait a minute, this is just cardboard. Yeah, exactly. What the heck? Um, all right, so we need Wilton boxes. Wilton boxes for cake? Should be here. Celebrate it. Where's not this Wilton? stuff? Celebrate it? It's all, all stuff over here? These boxes? No, it's it's Wilton. Oh, oh, not celebrate it. The Wilton boxes. So celebrate it. It's celebrated now, Wilton? Cardboard sheet boxes. <laughs> and celebrate it, change your name to, from Wilton? Seems like all they have is celebrate it. Let me see all Wilton. 12 inch. Oh, wait. Gift box Wilton. It's not Wilton, right? No. no. Um, let me try. Are these for cakes or something? Yeah. Does she put a replacement? <clears throat> Maybe like one of those ones of the brand that's actually all over the place? Nine. Is this okay. it by any chance? I found this over here. I don't know. I'm not really sure what you're looking for. So this is just by see built in. I don't know if this no, is no, anything. No. I'm not much of a baker or a candlestick Shoot. maker. Very funny. <laughs> Very funny. Two sets. I mean, this is what she wants, but. In, in a different brand. I wonder what kind of price difference you're looking at. And then the other one. So they have that one. And then this one is a 12 by 12, a, a 12 inch square. For a message here, I just want to. That's 12 inch. Huh? This is 12 inch square. I wonder why I don't have this Wilton. It's almost like it's like it's just all this one brand. Yeah. There's nothing next door in the Wilton. Uh, you just go double check that because I mean, like I said, I'm not, you know. I think they're like fading out the Wilton stuff. Yeah. What's this? No. no. It's a box. It's yeah, no, I saw. Do we see anybody that we can ask? Yeah, let me see if we can find somebody. Excuse me? You work here? Um, I'm looking for a, uh, a Wilton cake, bo cake box. I'm, I'm only seeing mostly celebrated. Are you guys like phasing out Wilton yeah. or? Yeah, we are. Okay. That would answer my question. Why? I'm finding it hard to find. Thank you so much. You're welcome. Yeah, Wilton's being phased out. Okay. I'm, uh, it seems that they're out of Wilton projects. Products. Um, so I'm saying it seems like they are out of most Wilton products, which they are phasing out as per the employee. They do have a brand named Celebrate It, and they have the two box size, the two size boxes you would like. Shall I exchange them for you? So it's actually it's this one because she wants two, which actually is perfect because this is a box of two and this is a box of two. Yeah, exactly. So the only thing is this doesn't have a window, which she wanted a window. Mm -hmm. I don't see any other. Yes, please. I need four boxes to hold eight. I need four boxes to hold t 10 to 12 inch cakes. Wait, I'm, I'm confused because she wanted a sheet cake one. She wanted two sheet cakes. Yeah. Well, if these come as, well, wait, if these come as two packs, that would be four. Right. And so she we, wants two right. of them. No, we would get two of this and two. And she wants one of these, which is two. She wants two of these and mm -hmm. two of these. Right. These sizes. Right. But she's saying she wants four of these. So she. Well, she's saying she needs four boxes. No, no. Yeah. Try to understand, okay? She, in her, in her, in her order, she wanted one of these. I know, I'm just paying attention to her message. Right, but that's what I have to clarify with her because she, that's not what she ordered. She ordered one of these and one of these. Oh, her, the ones she ordered were in two packs also? Well, she wanted two of these and two of these. Because in Wilton, you only can buy one at a time. They didn't have a package. Okay, so her. So, so I'm saying is the one that she ordered was not a two pack. It doesn't matter about that. She wanted. She wanted okay, a sheet. You, you do what you got to do. She wanted a sheet cake, and she wanted. Okay. Yeah, you don't. You don't. Okay. You don't. Yeah, I'm just yeah. doing the math. Yeah. Two the, times two is four. Right, but there were two different sizes. That's right. not what she asked in her order. Is what I'm saying. She wanted a nine, 19 inch sheet cake. She wanted two of these, and then a square, two squares. But she, now she's asking for four squares, so I just need to verify that she doesn't want this. Right. Do you understand? No, I understand what you're saying, yeah. 
Still don't get it. <laughs> yeah, I thought that she wanted a quantity of two, which would be four boxes. Well, on she her wants four order. boxes. Like I'm trying to think. I I don't know what her original order is because I don't have the phone on right. me. Right. So, so what I'm really telling know. you, what the order was. Yeah. She wanted two of these 19 inch, and she wanted two squares. Okay, and those but had now, two boxes in each. Right. Well, in the in these ones, the Wiltons don't. The Wiltons came one of the so one her, pack. right. The one, so the ones that yes. she ordered did not have two boxes. Right. But now each. she's asking for four boxes to hold 10 right. to 12 inch. So I I need to verify that she yeah, doesn't do want this. Yeah. I have a headache. Do we have two of these? <clears throat> yes. Yeah, this is like we're taking way too long. Yeah. Because this is the problem. They don't give you time for if you have to contact the, the customer. Right. Yes, she wants she wants two two of these. Perfect. Okay, okay so I'm so going she to she doesn't want any of the other one? Right. So I think she miss miss did it. Okay, so can't find, can't find. Wait. Um, how do I how do I replace again? Scan replacement. Yeah. No, wait, I'm confused. All right, can't find, mm -hmm. skip, select Slug replacement. Replacement. I don't know how, I don't know which one this is. Can the you 12 look? 12 by can, 12, this one? No, it's, uh, oh yeah. It's uh, 849. Okay, hold on. The units, we need two, and they were eight, eight, 849. 849. Okay, all right. What was the other message to sent you? I'll take two packs of the 12 by 12 box. It should be two in pack, yeah. Yeah. Okay. And then just, yeah, refund, I guess refund the other one, I guess. Yeah. Did you confirm with her that she does not want that other yes, size? Yes, that's what, that's what we were talking about. Okay. Yeah, she wants she wants two tw she wants two of packs of the 12 by 12, okay. which is four. Okay, cool. She needs four. All right. Okay. Good idea. <clears throat> and then um, can't find, refund. Yep. All right, well, at least she has directions. Thank goodness. Because, uh, you know, so you don't have to sit there and wait at the door like a mo. Hey, mo! All right, that was... That was it wasn't like, terrible. It's just it wasn't terrible, and she was great communicator. But it just would have been nice if they had like had like a sign like phasing out Wilton, so we right. would have known right away. Right, right, exactly. I don't know what the price difference is going to be. Going to be. I mean, how much was the other order? That was six dollars. Even if this goes down to like seventeen, back down to seventeen, still over twenty dollars that we did the first hour. Yeah, I mean, it might not even—it might not even really change much of anything because the, the quantity left, is still exactly the same. So it's just a matter well, of how much is Wilton right compared to no, how much is the other. because one. because everything was in because it actually ended up only being three items instead of instead of it being five item five units mm -hmm. because it was three items five units. It's it's too it's too so. bad it's too bad that we don't know what the original subtotal was supposed to be because ultimately that's how it it, it makes oh, up the difference. Yeah. Because if she did a percentage tip, which I'm assuming she probably did on this, she probably she probably didn't do a set tip. It's probably going to bring the tip down. Then, it'll, it, then what it does, it brings the tip down. It doesn't bring. I don't think it's going to bring the base pay down, but it would bring the tip down. So that's why it, it changes. It's not that. It's not that Instacart takes money back because the because the product isn't in. It's because of the of the. I keep I keep on wanting to say patient. It's because <laughs> um the the customers amount changes. Right. Exactly. And they do a percentage tip. Yeah. That's why on that order that we had the other day, that person did a set tip. So that's why the order Use didn't the right change despite the fact right that we had less items. Yeah. So we like those customers that don't do percentage tips. That just do a set tip. Do a set tip. They understand that when an item isn't in stock, you still have to work. It's not like it's like, oh, items not in stock, I didn't do anything. Mm -hmm. Items not in stock, you actually have to do more. It's more work when things aren't in stock you know, and less and I, work when something isn't in stock. And I understand why SHIP does the tip after, after the fact, but it's just annoying for the for the shopper. It really is. It is annoying for the shopper because if I was because if I'm a shopper and I give a tip pre, a pre tip, I want my shopper to know that. Yeah. So, you know, first of all the order gets taken a lot quicker and you're probably gonna get better service. Comment below, does anyone know if like if, if SHIP is gonna change that or if that's um I don't ever see them changing that. Based on the bounce house, I'm gonna say this is definitely the right house. Yes. Oh, uh, you put it all the way in the back? Yeah, it's in the back back. Um, do you have a mask? I think about the mask might have fallen out of the car. Whoopsies. Yep. All right, $19.98. Oh. So actually, uh, it ended up being a couple cents more. Yeah, time. no, that was exactly the same amount of money. Oh, was it? Okay, Yeah, because cool. I remember seeing it was $19.98. Perfect, all right. So we didn't get uh. We didn't get hoes. We didn't, yeah. Maybe she, did, maybe she didn't do a percentage tip. And maybe it came out to like the same amount of money. All right, uh, Alan Empanada. We got an Alan Empanada stack on the, on the West Isla. Where? Alan Empanada's on Deer Park Avenue. Okay. It's uh, it's an Alan Empanada Popeyes stack. Oh. What an interesting combo. Thirteen dollars and eighty-two cents uh, for five point nine miles total. Okay. We'll see how Sunday afternoon Popeyes is.
That's really asking for trouble. Maybe Sunday afternoon Popeyes isn't so bad. Mm. How's it going? Uh, picking up an Uber Eats order for uh, Hypatia M. Great. Thanks so much. Thank you. It smells so good. When are we getting all an empanada? Uh, for dinner tonight. <laughs> <laughs> smells so good. All right, so we got three apps in already. First three orders yeah. for possible Quintefka. Is ship gonna come alive today and show something today? I noticed when you drive, you don't like putting your blinker on until it's like your time to like turn. Me, I, I have oh, my blinker you. going like all the time. No, they they're com they can't see my blinker anyway. They're coming from the opposite side. I mean, they should know. Well, yeah, obviously. Yeah. And I, I, I don't want to be that that jerk to like. Like like you know, like, like when you're changing front. like when you're changing lanes like you are always very hesitant to put your blinker on until like well, you want to change the lanes but you don't put your blinker on until like you're getting yeah, close to actually being able to do it. Yeah, but I don't want to. I don't. I like. I I don't want to be that that unless like I can can do it. I don't want to turn the blinker on and just be like you know. I don't, oh, so I'm yeah. not that aggressive. Oh, I see, yeah, yeah, I turn the blinker on because I want people to know what I want to do. Yeah, I like, just I want them to know like I want to be really trying to get over. I want to know that I can do it, and then I'll turn the blinker on, and then I'll do it. Uh, I'm a very safe driver, Nick. Yeah, we we change lanes differently. <laughs> Unless we're in traffic and, and I know I got to get over, then 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 I do that because there's no way that they can't know. they have to know. Yeah. Hi, uh, Jonathan R for Uber. Yeah. Uh, it's just for Jonathan, yeah, for Uber. Thank you. Have a good one. I assume straws are in the bag, right? Straws are in the bag. Straws are in the bag. Straws. Yeah, straws. Right in the bag. Thank you. Thank you very much. Uh, back door. What? Leave that door. Back door, leave the door. Leave at the back door? Yeah, I guess so. Is that what they're saying? It's an apartment. In a, in a, apartment in is a, back door apartment, so. In a uh, in a roundabout way? Yeah. Hopefully there's no truck there's hopefully there's no truck yard back there. Mm -hmm. At least it's during the day. Yeah, I was gonna say at least it's like during the day. Is it that? There's like a there's one twenty. This is, no, no, no. There's um, there's like a down, there's like a, a basement apartment kind of thing. But they said back. I said back door. Okay. Waiting car. Good old waiting car. Good old waiting car. Where yeah. is it? Picking up from the South Shore Mall. All right, we'll go to McDonald's next. Okay. Seven dollars, two point eight miles, under a dash. Hello? Hi, how are you? Hi. Are you outside? Yeah, I'm outside. Okay. Thanks so much. Yeah, no problem. Got it. Yeah. Have, a good one. Have a great day. I didn't even check power for this one. Just because it was just like already on the surface, a good order. I mean, it's $5, so yeah. it's not going to have anything different. No, seven. Oh. Uh, $4 tip. Yeah, it was seven for 2.9 miles. Yeah. It's I going. think it's just soft drinks. I'm uh, picking up a 521. Okay, thanks so much. Have a good day. That was one unhappy McDonald's uh, employee. Oh. Wouldn't you be grumpy too? <laughs> yeah, she was not having a great day. She's not having a good day? Yeah, she was not having a good day. Not a happy camper. Seems like lately McDonald's, I don't know. Just terrible? Yeah. They, they, they started off like really good. They've been great. Like, they, were, they were great for like a long time. And it just mm -hmm. seems like now McDonald's is... Become the new tackle. That's a little extreme. Nah, I, I wouldn't put them to that level yet. I mean, you know, there's no like no, 10 they, minute no, waits there, but it, but no, it, they, it they, hasn't been ready. They're, it, they're getting there. Yeah, it used to be like it, that was always ready. Now it's not always ready sorry. anymore. Turn no, nah, I'm not gonna put them on the Taco Bell level because they're still working. And Taco Bell works too. Like I, I, I'm, 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 I'm not gonna bother Taco Bell as much because they work. They were constantly working. Like to me, at this point now, like Wendy's and Popeyes are are, are clearly at the bottom. Mm. At the stop sign, it's not even a question. Because Popeyes question employees, they just they just stand around. Like at least these other places, like they're working. It's just that the volume, you know, really what it seems like to me, like what I'm seeing at McDonald's now, is I'm seeing a lack of employees. Before, they were like, it was like ants. There were like that many employees mm -hmm. all over the place. It seems like now there aren't as many employees. But the volume isn't the, changing. Right, the volume isn't People are still changed. ordering McDonald's, like, like mm -hmm. up the wazoo, um, on every way possible, drive through, coming in, the apps. Now, now they're at the point they can't keep up, which is also the Taco Bell order issue. Mm -hmm. Taco Bell doesn't have enough employees. They can't keep up with the, with the volume of orders coming in. 
Is there instructions? Because there's it's two doors. Entertainment. All right. Entertainment. Joey D's Entertainment Plus Temporary Clothes. I guess it's a house now. Yep, and we're right there. Yeah. Let's leave that door. Well, because there was another door on the side, so maybe that's where they have their like business. Oh. It looks like she wants Sarah McDonald's. Yes. Because she got a bunch of Happy Meals, so she has a bunch of kids that drive her. Yeah, they, they're right. like, oh, mommy. Yeah. Mommy, I want my food. She does not look happy. Because she's got three kids waiting for Happy Meals. <laughs> Hi, I get it. You're waiting for all these Happy Meals. Thank you. Thank you. What? <laughs> all these Happy Meals. I get yes. it. By the kids, like, where, where are the Happy Meals coming? Yep. Have a great day. All right, we can take this. Uh, Brownstone Coffee, six dollars fifty cents, one point five miles. You know where it is, right? Yeah. Union Boulevard. Yeah. We'll take that. I would assume I'm getting coffee. Uh, sriracha toast, a latte, and a sandwich. I think it's our first Brownstone Coffee pickup. Mm-hmm. Well, because we they're only uh, breakfast and lunch, so. Yeah. All right, we thought this would be a heavy-duty shopping day, and it turned out to be a food day. Mm-hmm. See, you, you never, never know. You just never know you what never know. in their brain. And we've never picked up from here, so who knows? Like, when we went to go eat there, it was very busy and crowded. Yeah, it and was crazy. So we're the food is go. really good, though. Yeah, it was great. Uh, getting an add-on. $7.50 for an additional 4.8 miles. Going over to West Babylon-ish area. So, no, $7.50. I'd All say right. we take it. Yeah. I say we take it. Nothing else going on. Exactly. Let's go pick up both these orders. Now it might be a little bit of weight just because it's two orders. Unless they're good at the tablet. They should be. I don't know if I'm going to need, what I'm going to have to get ready here. Cause if, do I, let me just check, see, the second person. Oh, great. The second person's not even getting coffee. All right, cool. So there's only one coffee out of all these. Excellent. Hi, uh, picking up two DoorDash orders. One, uh, one for Donald, Donald H and the other one's for Ariel A. I think you're Donald. Donald yes. yeah. Thank you so much. Have a good one. Have a good one. Drink here, which oh. is for Donald. Oh, that's nice. They yeah. have the, the name on there. Oh, yeah. No, it's great. Great bags. And they were ready. So they, they know, know how to use the button. They know how to use the button. The only people don't know how to use the button are fast food places. It seems like most of the time at pizza places. Oh, nice. The second brownstone coffee we got actually is a confirmed hidden tip. It's actually a uh, Ten dollar fifty cent order. Oh, so awesome. total, so total on the stack, we're doing ten fifty plus at least six fifty. But I don't think there'll be a hidden tip on the six dollar fifty cent. No. So ten fifty plus six fifty is what eighteen dollars. Like the, the little things like that go overlooked very easily. Mm -hmm. Eighteen dollars. Like we do shopping orders for eighteen dollars. Yeah. This is just we just picked up a brownstone. And how, and how long? When did you get the the first order? And the yeah the first order I got at uh twelve fifty. So nine minutes ago. And we'll have this order finished in the next 10 minutes. We should, yeah, should have it done in the next 10 minutes. Freaking so 20 minutes great. and eight, $18. Eight, 18 bucks. And this person tipped well for their rounds down. They yeah. know. They know it's not close. Yeah, I mean, do we have a subtotal on this? I'm curious. Subtotal is $35.11. And, and they tipped $8.50. And they tipped $8.50. That's, that's, that's a great that, tipper. That's a good tipper. That's a great tipper. Uh, yep, hidden tip confirmed. It's time to party. So that Our was, was correct. So that was an eighteen dollar. Yep. Uh, <laughs> ship. <laughs> I mean, do you want to get some coffee? So, I mean, you know, we'd be if we were working our regular jobs right now. We totally would be having afternoon coffee, Mary. <laughs> we'd totally be having our afternoon coffee and an afternoon snack. You're such a bad influence. What? <laughs> afternoon coffee is better than having nighttime coffee. Did they have bacon? Uh, I don't know. They, I don't know, they, but they it smells some, really good. They had some sandwiches. It smells really good, whatever yeah, it was. Yeah, some good smell like, came out of that bag. Yeah, that's what's so good about these bags. Like, literally, it didn't smell until you opened it yeah. up, and now, like... And then it's like, okay, I, I want to eat something okay. right now. Do we want Dunkin'? Do we want 7-Eleven? Um, I want iced coffee, so I would say Dunkin'. Dunkin'. If we have the option. Yay! Do it! If it's, like, here... I mean, it's not right here, but if I start driving towards it, we can... Why is that not shutting up? Yeah, I, I want to just throw your phone through the window. <laughs> <laughs> no, because what happens is, like, whenever, like, my phone does something stupid, like, not being able to get signal... All the signals come through? Yeah. It's so dumb. Yeah, like, where are we going to get Duncan? There's one on Sunrise Highway. The one that always closes early. I always forget about that one. Oh, the one by Popeyes? No, no, no. Yeah. Oh, that, oh, the other one. That, yeah, that the we best. always forget about. We, we used to go there all the time when we lived in that area. 
Yeah, okay, that works. Or we can go to the one um, on 109 by by Energy Fuel, and we'll be like in a hub of like things. Yeah, let's let's go to that one because like that one makes more sense anyway, considering where we're going right now. Yeah. Oh, nice. Here we go. It's perfect. Jensen's De- Deli. Jensen's. Yeah, uh, Jensen's Deli. Eight dollars and eighty three cents for three point seven miles. We're gonna be right over there getting the Dunkin' Donuts. And then we go and we pick up the. Uh, we go pick. We go pick up this. It's right next door. Yeah, I'm just trying to think logistics, but yes. Hi. Um, yeah. Uh, two medium iced butter pecan coffees with almond milk. I'm gonna get a donut. I don't want to bless you. Thank you. Yeah, yeah, that, yeah, that works. Yeah, ten assorted munchkins. <clears throat> That's it. Actually, just nothing, nothing powdery. I don't want anything yeah. powdery. Just nothing powdery. All right, where are we going? Oh, Jessen's. Yeah, right across the street. Yep. This couldn't, right have, a- couldn't have worked out perfectly, or perfectly, or perfectly, or. It's like they knew. It was like I think they're going to that Duncan. First time ever picking up on Gen- uh, Jessen's for the. Uh, I don't want to call them Jessen's. 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 On the channel. <laughs> I'm picking up an Uber for a Giovanna S. Giovanna? Yep. Giovanna. There we go. Awesome. Thanks Thank so much. Thank you very much. Have a great day. Take care, you too. Right, from your assessment? Because uh, this is the... This is the... That's the great. V. That's great. Well, that's great East Neck yeah, Road so there. We so, go. we like our car. <laughs> I'm aware of my surroundings. Except for that one time. Except for that one time. Where? I was... I was Turn left onto in the right. clouds. My head was in the clouds. Yep. I admit it. It happens. Clouds. Especially when you're doing this stuff. You think it's hard doing it together. Just try, just yeah. try doing this by yeah, yourself, no. Mary. It's never. It's definitely. It's, it's, I, I like. It's not I would, easy sometimes. Well, obviously, I would never do food delivery. But um, if I ever like did the shopping on my own, it would be, definitely be like, all right, take an order and then do it. Yeah. And I, then, well, like, I would never like. I think the thing is, like, when you're doing shopping, I think it makes it a little bit easier because you're not driving around as much. Right. And so you're, like, yards when you're doing you're food delivery. You're basically, like... But it would be... The thing with that is, like, what do you do... Comment below. What do you do if you're just a shopper? And do you find a spot then after you drop? Because you can't, like, sit in front of the... the I keep on wanting to say patience all day. You can't sit in front of the customer's house... Yeah, you so know you where? Just, where do you go? Do you do you find like the closest shopping center? Comment yeah. below. Where do you go? Yeah, that's that's what I would say you do. And now this still does become an aspect of like looking at your phone while you're driving and glancing over. Right. Um, but even more so, you can't analyze orders. You just got to take it and exactly. Then look at it. You yeah, that's why a lot of times like I'll see something and I'll be like, oh, check that out, you know, yeah. while we're driving. Yeah. Uh, please leave food right on the stoop. Do not knock on the door or ring bell. The dogs will lose it. Bark! 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 All right. Well, they're, uh, they're probably going to lose it regardless. Yeah, they, they smell me. Oh. On oh, that first stack we did on Uber ends up coming to uh, $22.90. So that we, we got that at $14? The Uber? The Uber, yeah, the Uber stack came in at thirteen eighty two. Uh, it ended up becoming uh, twenty two dollars. Wow, and that was almost a ten dollar hidden. Yeah. Wow. Pretty so cool. they both. Well, we don't know. Door dash six fifty McDonald's six fifty two point three miles. Actually, I don't mind it because I really need to pay. TMI. <gasps> What's the tip on it? Uh, Three dollars fifty cent tip. All right, we could do this at McDonald's. Keep moving, and I and I can use the bathroom. Yes, yeah, so that's pretty. That's great. Twenty two dollars and ninety cents. Supposed to be thirteen dollars and eighty-two cents. So somebody tipped. Let me see what the tips look like on this one. What's cool about Uber is at least you can see the breakdown of tips. Mm-hmm. Wow, one customer we delivered to tipped one dollar. Oh, the other customer we delivered to tipped seventeen dollars and eight cents. Wow. Wow. Totally made up for. <laughs> yeah. And That's, hence why they stack that one with that one. Because right, they, t- they stacked this crappy order with this guy who took... And they were, they're lucky that the orders were going like in the same proximity too. And think about how crappy that is for this guy who tipped seventeen dollars and eight cents. Wait, that was the that was the brownstone. No, we picked up Popeyes and 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 the empanada place. Which one? Which one was which? The empanadas was the seventeen dollar. That I don't know, but I would think it was the Popeyes actually. Really? Because 
it says customer one, customer two, and the empanada customer was customer one. So Popeyes would have been customer two. So it was the Popeyes guy who was tipped seventeen dollars and change. My name's Sarah. Could I help What's you? What's going on? I'm picking up a DoorDash uh, four three zero, which I'm not seeing up there. Um, okay, I think we're working on it. Four three zero, Danny. Four three zero. Yeah. Okay, let me, we'll take a let me see what's going on with that. Yeah. It's just one item. It's a quarter pound of a cheese meal. Uh, yeah, we're, we're working on it. Okay, just want to make sure you had it and make yeah, sure it didn't yeah. get taken away okay, or something. Um, All right, cool. 4.30. Thank you so much. Have a good one. Apparently, a freaking $10.50 uh, Uber for hurricanes going like no mileage came in while I was in the bathroom. Oh, yeah. And you missed it? Yeah, I totally would have canceled this McDonald's for... Uh, well, we could have done it. You fool. Yeah, we could have done both, honestly, yeah, especially with freaking... Hurricanes always hurricanes, take, yeah. takes forever. But... Because this is right around the corner. Yeah, but... And it's an apartment. I don't know if you saw... I was going potty. Yeah, so... Nice thing about today is, no matter what, I mean, unless, unless we had no orders in the last hour, we're going to do $25 an hour today, mm -hmm. which is pretty great, considering it hasn't really been... You know, we did one shopping order. Yeah, that's 800s. What, what is the number again? 1001. So we're looking for 10. 10, looking yeah, for 10. the 10s. That's 7s. 15s, jeez. Like any, oh, there's, oh, no oh, oh. there's no rhyme or reason. Are we at the, are we at the Avalon? Feels like it. 5. This is like how the Avalon is. 6. We'll just run into 10s at some point. I guess we'll just, yeah, exactly. Watch, it's going to be like in the front of the, the complex. One zero zero one. One zero zero one. Yeah. These are the ones. Eleven. Oh my gosh. Did we pass it? Was it like the first building? It might have been the first building. It probably was. Maybe it was. How much you want to bet it's this building? We just took a tour of this place. One zero zero five. One zero zero eight. Oh. Right here. Yeah, one zero zero. Literally, we were right here. We we just drove in around the entire complex. Let me pull in here. Yeah, we just drove around the entire. All right. Complex. Well, now we know this complex. We never we've never delivered to this complex, so now we know each group is numbered. Oh, hello. Yes. Hello, trees. <laughs> we we got we got a nice tour. Oh, oops, wrong door. Sorry. All right. Well. I just rang their doorbell. I don't know why I thought that was 1001. All right. Thank Have you, a great day. You too. <laughs> did you really go to the wrong door? Yeah, bring it around. <laughs> Which number did you go to? 1004, zero, zero, uh, but I mean, three? That's all right. They <laughs> didn't pay the rent anyway. Their, their rent is. Uh, the rent's 14 days past. Oh, down. the one with the paper had yeah, just passed you? Yeah, the, one I, rang, the, the rang, one I rang doorbell. Whoops. Nor food. Is it no mileage? Yeah, it's 3.2 uh, two miles, $3.50 tip. All right. Keep it going. Uh, waffle Magic. Oh, okay. Waffle Magic. So Was this, it This is actually going to happen. Yeah, $6 for an additional 0 0.7 miles. Perfect. We're actually going to do a Waffle Magic. Cool. Uh, DoorDash for Chris M. Great, thanks so much. Have a great day. Hi. So I'm picking up a DoorDash for Vincent M. Great. Thank you. Thank you so much. Have a great one. Thank you. Oh, is that Boba? Uh, no, this is uh, this is um, uh, Waffle Magic. Yeah, that's it. Oh, okay, great. Boba tea. Thank you. Have a good one. You too. You sure? Boba tea? It was... Uh, yeah, it's tea. Boba tea and... Uh, the vanilla milk. Okay. For Vincent. Okay, great. What you got? Nothing. Uh, all right, that was at least seven bucks. Uh, what do we got here? Sobo. Hang on. It's going to be too many miles. No, no, no. No, uh, Sobo over here. All right, cool. This is work. Six dollars fifty cents. One point one miles. Oh, we have a Sobo over here. Yeah, you didn't know that? No. Yeah, right on uh, on Hoffman. What's Hoffman? Go past this yeah, light. Oh my God! It's point two miles away. They could walk here. Yeah. They could have walked here. It's a nice day out today. Uh, Hi, so I'm picking up an Uber for Nicole Q. Yeah. Great, thanks Have so much. Blue. Have a great day. Some smoothies? Uh, I think it's the side bowls. Hang on, meet at door, on the steps by apartment, uh, in the backyard, through the white gate, to the front of the house. Pita bowl. Seven dollars, 1.8 miles. Doing that next? Next up. All right. Keep it rolling. You're welcome. 
Want me to just leave it over here? Okay. Have a great day. Easy peasy. Yep. Man, we have literally been nonstop today. Well, I'm getting up to people on Uber too. I mean, we should just take this also. Do it. Since the other one is and then, and then so few of miles. And that's, we're going to end it. Yeah. We'll end it with these two last pita balls. Great. The other one's going three point something miles for 8,000 change. And this yeah, one's well, only 1.1 1 .1 miles. Yeah, we'll figure out And we got to get the pita bowl. We'll figure out which one. Yeah, well, yeah, the, the door this one will drop off first because this one's going to be re really close. Mm -hmm. And then drop off the other one, which is in Copac, the Uber one. And then that's it. Yeah, it's perfect. Yeah, we can even still get an order on the way home. Yeah. On the way back, because you know the one you said. Because we're going to be in Copac. Copac, yeah. Yeah. Man, we've been we've been nonstop today, huh? Well, the, well, this this afternoon, like since that last, we sat at um, the Seven Eleven, and then since then, it's we've been going. Yeah. It's a beautiful thing. Not and you know for a day like you like we said earlier, like a day that we thought we'd be doing a lot of shopping. Yeah, it's been a lot of food like, orders. And we've been getting decent food orders. I mean, we've gotten a lot of bad food orders, of course, but there's been a good amount of decent food orders, so. Ooh, a lot of, a lot oh. of low mileage. Yeah, which is great. I'm going to say the opposite of what I said also before. If you're doing food shopping apps, don't just rely on food shopping apps. Also do food delivery <laughs> apps. Right. Do them all. Because you never know what day, which one's going to be hopping. Yeah. You think today is Sunday, it's a big food shopping day. All the food shopping orders have been terrible. But the food delivery orders have been good. They've, they've been steady and consistent. Now that's how I like it. And now we got a, a multi-app stack here with DoorDash and Uber, repeatable. How's it going? Um, I'm picking up a DoorDash and an Uber. Yes. The DoorDash is for Emily N, and the Uber is for Peter D. Emily's all done, but it would just be a second. Okay, yep, no problem. Can I smile for the camera? What was that? Can I smile for the camera? You can absolutely smile oh, for the camera. See it. Yeah. <laughs> I will say, by the way, pita bowl by far the best, the best bowls anywhere. And not even close. Awesome. Yeah. Thanks so much. Have a, Have a great day. Take care. Let's see, we got. Sherbrooke, uh, Emily's going first. Emily's first. This is Uber Eats. If you're doing this, make sure you guys keep your stuff organized. Know whose order is whose. <laughs> You don't want to deliver to the wrong customer at any stack, but especially when you're multi-app stacking. Multi-app stack. Stack it. Multi-app stack. How's it going? Let's leave it over here. It's fine? Yeah, perfect. Yep. Okay. No problem. And that would close out our shift on this beautiful Sunday day. We ended up finishing with a total of $126.34, just missing our goal of $130. We worked a total of four hours, making our dollar per hour $31.59. We drove a total of 50 miles, which made that $2.53 per mile. Till next time, I'm Lou, she's Mary, and we're the Long Island Dash Experience. See ya.